What's going on guys? This is my Glock 34. I've done a lot of work to this recently. What I was going for was an agency arms kind of look. I didn't want to spend $2,500 on a Glock and I really wanted the 34 model of the agency so I decided to build one for myself. I sent it off to a company or well, I sent the slide off to a company called Jaegerworks. Uh, I got the breacher cut on it. It's got huge windows on the side and uh, it's got really aggressive front serrations at an angle. I also personally did my own bull nose cut because if you guys know the agency 34 they always have a bull nose cut and a and jaeger wouldn't do it for me which is totally fine i asked them if they could they respectfully said they couldn't then i stippled it uh with a really nice fine uh, almost velvety type stipple job it's not super sticky it's not super slippery it's definitely a really nice blend it's definitely better than the stock uh stipple kind of or whatever the heck pattern they that glock sends it out stock with Got rid of the finger grooves because I hate those freaking things. Uh, relief trigger finger or middle finger cut, relief uh, support hand cut, and then I also did the uh, uh, relief cut for uh, the way that Paul Van Dunk shoots. I've been watching how he shoots his Glocks and how he sets up his uh, relief cuts, and I really wanted to try it myself. I had never shot a gun like that, and I was really wanting to. And if anything, if I didn't like it, I could just go back to the standard, use this relief cut. What he actually does is he rides his pointer finger in between his trigger guard and his flashlight and he runs his middle finger underneath that and he gets almost like an AFG kind of angled grip like literally putting his hand up in here like this and shooting it like that he gets really aggressive on it which is really cool and I thought that that would really help with recoil so far in about 400 rounds it seems to be uh, just exactly what I thought a really a great way to shoot a, a 9 millimeter, especially a 34 definitely uh, really accurate really smooth uh, recoil the uh, the cuts in this thing definitely have lightened the slide up but I believe that it's not too much of a reduction to actually hurt the uh, the firearm uh, I got an IDP tactical flat face trigger got it on eBay I think they have an eBay store it's uh, made out of metal just popped out my first my uh, original one and threw it on my trigger bar then I got a 3.5 connector this isn't a, uh, a three gun uh, firearm this is mainly just like a a range gun and a bedside gun if anything throw in the holster when shit hits the fan and uh, I'll have uh, one of the coolest looking freaking Glocks I really uh, am happy how it came out hope you guys like it and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one